101.1 Smart FM, KG Radio Network. Good evening, smart listener. Welcome to Smart Up Your Life. Grab your confidence in speaking English. This is our English learning program in collaboration with BPC Makassar. And tonight, I am Rifa Majid as your host. And also, I have several, uh, actually two friends from BPC Makassar who will be with you during this airing program. And now... I will introduce them to you. I have, we have actually, we have Nahwi here. Hi Nahwi, what's up? Okay, fine as usual. Your microphone, I, I, I can hear your voice. No, 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 not yet. <laughs> Wait. Oh my God. Yeah. We will oh, change. Now? Nah, yeah, okay. it's a Is good. Is it clear? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, hello Better. guys. Yeah. I'm fine as usual. <laughs> thank you for coming. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and also we have Hyrule here. Hi everybody. I'm What's up? Good and cold as water. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. All right. And tonight also we have um, additional um, speaker from. He is an English an English enthusiast and also oh. influencer, but. Wow. He will join us next, oh, uh, the next uh, segment, next okay. session of um, Smart Up Your Life. But before we move to the main topic of our conversation tonight, uh, Nahwi wants to introduce BPEC to okay. you, smart listener, because this um, program is the collaboration program from mm. BPEC Makassar and also mm. Smart FM Makassar. Please. Okay, thank you for um opportunity that given to me. So as usual, I'd like to introduce to you about BPEC. So basically, BPEC is abbreviation of Benteng Panyua English Club, uh, which is situated at Port Rotterdam, Makassar. Mm. And then, uh, this is one of the oldest English community. And then in here, we uh, learn, we study a lot of things, uh, especially in English, start from uh, grammar, pronunciation, and etc. And then for those who wants to increase or improve your speaking skill or maybe your English, please visit us. Uh, but right now we are facing a corona outbreak, so we conduct our uh, meeting through virtual uh, every Sunday at uh, 2 p.m. until 4 p.m. at Google Meet. And then for next information, for further information, you can ask us in our Instagram at BPC Makassar mm-hmm. and also our Facebook, BPC Makassar. And yeah, we, we also have WhatsApp. You can check it out in Facebook or Instagram itself. I think okay. that's all. Thank so, Hyrule, why should we join the weekly meeting of BPC Makassar? From okay. your point of view. Yeah, so a lot of benefits that you can get from joining our weekly meeting, mm-hmm. such as a public speaking, to in, to increase your public speaking skill, and also mm-hmm. to increase and improve your speaking skill in, in English, actually. Mm-hmm. And getting more links and relations, and many friends, okay. new friends from any backgrounds, such as from different... Uh, majors and different university. All right, there are many benefits yeah. that you can get if you join the weekly meeting of BPEC Makassar. Yes. And um, you can also join with us tonight, smart listener, on our WhatsApp 08114610011, and also you can watch our live streaming on YouTube channel Smart FM Makassar. Yes. Well. Mm. Talking about the language, mm-hmm. uh, which is uh, BPC has uh, their own weekly meeting to increase, to improve the English language. Now, you know, every country has their own cultures and also languages, right? Yes, of course. Such as us in mm-hmm. Indonesia. Indonesian mm-hmm. people, um, we have a lot of languages um, and also tribe, mm-hmm. including the slang itself. Of course. Right? Yes. Okay. Such as uh, example, example, we are in Makassar. Mm-hmm. We have a lot of slang language. Of course. It's totally <laughs> true. It's totally true. Yeah. Sometimes so, we combine Bahasa uh, with uh, our own con- culture languages itself. So uh-huh. it uh, produces a lot of kinds of slang itself. Okay. Yeah. Please give uh, an example. 
give the example of this our our slang language in Makassar that very popular. Oh well, yeah. Talking about slang languages, yeah, uh, we cannot deny that every country, every um, every region has their own uh, slang languages. Mm-hmm. And then, yeah, for us, especially in Makassar, we have a lot of uh, slang lang- languages itself. Um, based on my experience that uh, I have learned before, when I was uh, maybe child, my childhood, mm-hmm. I found a lot of uh, slang lang- languages. Sometimes we combine it with uh, our Bahasa and our uh, local like language uh, itself. Um, let me give like some examples. If I'm not mistaken, at the moment, I really, um, what is that? Uh, kepo, kepo, <laughs> kepo meaning that uh, you wanna you wanna know more yes. about the information and also about uh, if I'm not mistaken, um, GPL, GPL meaning that GPL. Gak pake lama. Gak pake lama. <laughs> and then it's totally it's totally uh, popular when I was um senior high school. Yeah. <laughs> until and now, until I think. Now, yeah. <laughs> So yeah. um, what about you, Mr. Hayoko? Uh, the slang language. The others, maybe, you know, like sota. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's, uh-uh. It means sotau. Yeah. And I don't know the others. Yeah, it just, just that. <laughs> otewe, yeah. otewe. Ah, otewe. <laughs> otewe, otewe. The abbreviation of on the way. On the way. On the way. Mm-hmm. That's become our daily language, right? Daily, yeah. Yeah. And every people, everybody was familiar with that word. Yeah, of yeah. course. Nah. So, based on that experience and also based on the current issue right now that people talk in every platform of social media mm-hmm. about the slang language itself, So our topic tonight, we we gonna talk about the slang on a daily conversation. Oh, slang okay. on a daily conversation. Yes. If you have an uh, experience, smart listener, how you use the slang language on your daily conversation, you can share your story with us tonight on WhatsApp no delapan satu satu empat enam satu nol satu satu and also uh, like I said before, you can write down your comment on our live streaming. On YouTube channel Smart FM Makassar. Okay. But we have to know. Firstly, we have to know what is the definition of this slang itself. Mm, okay. Hyrule or Nahwi, maybe okay. from your point of view. Maybe Mr. Hyrule. Yeah. For me, the slang is a combination of two words or mm-hmm. more that we cannot find in dictionary actually mm-hmm. because it's informal. Oh, so yeah, you found it on people mm. and on a daily conversation. Okay. It's yes. not it's not uh for the written or uh, written usage but it's it's a spoken usage. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. It's a it's spoken usage and we cannot find the word on uh, dictionary. In, in, the, in dictionary. Yeah. Right? Like yeah. in KBBI you, you cannot found otewe <laughs> yeah. or yeah. kepo or yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> something like mm. that. So in your opinion? Uh, we... For me, yeah. Maybe uh, it's similar with Mr. Hyrule. So mm-hmm. yeah, it's like combination of yeah some words and then uh, it's usually found in uh, daily conversation. So Uh, this word categorized as spoken language, mm. not written language, like uh, Mr. Hyrule uh, has taught us before. Yeah, I think that's all. Okay, the mm-hmm. spoken language, spoken language. <laughs> that means the people made, made yeah. it, right? Yeah. People the people made it. made it, the people created. Yeah, yeah. of course. Not uh, uh, like to what? To simplify things, actually. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes, yeah. to simplify. Yeah, <laughs> correct. <laughs> okay, but we will uh, continue. How often? Did you use the slang language on your daily conversation every day? Live smart listener and we talk about a slang on a daily conversation. Please, Nahu and Harold, mention the word or the slang word that are familiar and popular in this year. Hmm. And also, like, I, I, I give you an example. Like, yeah, Bucin. Oh, okay. <laughs> it means... Uh, budak cinta. Oh, okay. <laughs> who, wow. who this uh-huh. word um, for the person describe the person who like being crazy oh. because of love. Oh. 
Oh okay. my God. <laughs> Sacrifice for love. Yes. Sacrifice everything oh, in the yeah. name of love. Oh my God. <laughs> What about you, Mr. Hayekal? Did uh, you have some words? Yeah, because the advance of technologies and also mm. social media. Mm. Yeah. We also found on social media like Bucin, mm. Gaje, oh. Gabut. Yeah. What, What is, is that? Gaje? Gaje is gak jelas. Gak jelas. Oh. In English? Gabut. How to say Gaje in English? Uh, I don't know. It's not clear. <laughs> yeah, unclear. Not clear. Unclear. 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 Okay. Gabut. It means gak butuh. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, yeah but, useless. But, lah. I think, but, <laughs> but I think Gabut really? is... Uh, uh, many perspective, many um, yeah. opinion about mm. gabut word yes. itself, like gabut gak butuh mm. or gabut galabut oh. <laughs> or There are a lot um, of perspective, anyway. gabut gaji buta oh. and many meanings <laughs> oh. of this word. Okay, <laughs> based on uh, yeah, the people perspective. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know it anyway. <laughs> yeah, this is new information for me. Okay. <laughs> What about so, you? Okay, so yeah, like Mr. Hegel said before, um, I have some uh, I have some uh, words. Mm. Uh, for the uh, the first word is gaptek. Gaptek yep. meaning that uh, someone who didn't know uh, a lot about technology mm -hmm. and then yeah. Yeah. and slowly yeah. slowly understand uh, the technology slowly understand and then uh, the next word is maybe uh, the synonym of it is kudet kudet meaning that kurang update mm -hmm. yes. <laughs> yeah so how to say in english <laughs> kudet kurang update uh, we can say in english Like uh, you didn't, you didn't, uh, you didn't follow the, the era. Trend. You didn't follow the trend itself. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, all uh -huh. right. You, you don't. Uh, you don't have an update information. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> all that. right. Now I challenge you uh -huh. to say the slang word in Indonesian, but you have to translate it to English. Oh, wow. okay. Like wait, uh, gercep. Gercep. Uh, you know what this mean? Yeah, gercep in bahasa gerakan cepat. Uh, who gercep? He yeah. get. <laughs> I don't know. How to say in English? <laughs> Gerakan cepat. Uh, moving. Uh, oh, fast, fast moving. Move. No, no, no. no. no quick, what? quick fit. Quick fit. Yeah. Quick fit. Oh. Like, uh, yeah, they have a quick fit. You know? Oh, yeah. Okay. All oh. right. Quick fit. Quick fit. Oh. <laughs> quick fit. So, yeah. next word What is, is halu. Halu. What it mean? What did halu. I say? It means, it means uh, this the halusin. abbreviation of halusinasi. Oh. Like, halu. you have too much expectation and mm. dream that like impossible to okay, reach. Uh, I have uh, an idiom that maybe relate with that word. Mm. Uh, that idiom is when the pig fly. So it express something that it's impossible to happen. For when example, the pig? when the pig fly. Okay, it means <laughs> uh, okay. so something impossible to happen. Okay. To express. Mm. Yeah, uh, then we can say that like halu. 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 halu is when the pig is fly, fly. Uh -huh. because to okay. express something that may be impossible to yeah, happen yeah 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 uh, um okay. the mean from the sentence and word yeah like yeah the same mean yeah the same i meaning. say mean makna yeah. yes okay <laughs> so next uh, japri oh you japri. know it is japri uh, uh the japri Yeah, direct message. Direct yes, message. Oh. direct message. <laughs> It's interesting. You, anyway. you send directly uh, to me. Yeah, yeah. DM. Privately. DM. Yes. So how to say in English? Oh, direct message. Is it is it correct when I say direct message? Direct message. Direct and... direct message. Yes. Privately. Yeah. Privately. All right. So what, what about next? <laughs> uh, mager. Oh, lazy. Mager. Like <laughs> you are in a lazy situation to move, lazy. even to take a drink or. <laughs> oh, I have uh, an idiom about it. Okay. Uh, you can say an idiom lazy bone. Lazy oh, bone meaning lazy that bone. someone who is really lazy. Lazy okay. bone. Uh, lazy bone. bone. For example, wake up, lazy bone. bone. Okay. Lazy bone is a person that yeah is really lazy. Bone that refers to lang. Yeah, <laughs> lazy bone, lazy okay. bone. Tulang malas in bahasa. <laughs> okay, well, mager we can say in English, lazy bone. Lazy bone. Kut kutu in Makassar. Kutu, <laughs> correct. Kutu, <yeah. laughs> lazy bone. Okay, that's our traditional language. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, halu? Halu is when, when the pig fly. When the pig fly. When the pig fly. All right. Next, pansos. Pansos. Beef. 
What is the variation of pansos anyway? Panjat sosial. <laughs> like you want to uh, be famous um, and then you um, approach some someone who uh, has many followers, mm. who has um, like influencers, celebrities and etc. Okay. You approach them and then you also follow them to be Famous to be popular. Uh, actually, parasite. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Pansos wow. is a parasite. parasite. Yes. It's oh, true. Yeah. It's yeah. true. Right? But <laughs> I have got uh, one term in English. Maybe uh, it's quite similar with that term. Mm-hmm. So in English, you can say virtual signaling. Virtual signaling meaning that uh, the someone is try to is trying to get attention mm-hmm. in social media. Virtual okay. signaling. Uh, I got the, this the, term. The, the writing of the word? Uh, virtual signaling. Okay. Virtual signaling. Oh, signaling. Huh? signaling. Yeah, signaling. Virtual signaling. How to say? Uh, virtual signaling. So signaling. I got, yeah, right. I got this term when I joined in debate competition. Nice. Okay. Yeah, virtual signaling. Okay, virtual signaling. Uh, uh, it means... Someone is trying to get uh, attention, attention to the public uh, <laughs> using social media. Okay. Or using controversial. Uh, of course. <laughs> Okay, yeah, and we can signal. say in Indonesia, pansos. pansos. Uh-huh. All right. It's, uh, it's, it has a similar meaning. <laughs> okay, so mantul. Mantul. <laughs> mantul. Ah, excellent. Mantul. Superb. Excellent. Yeah, you can say also. Excellent. excellent. Another yeah. word maybe? Oh my God. Superb. Amazing. Yeah. You can say amazing, amazing. also. Amazing. Amazing. Extraordinary. Yeah. All right. Amazing. Uh-huh. Extraordinary. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Mantul. Mantap mantul. betul. Mantul. <laughs> <laughs> so aka aka as known as as known as uh-uh. okay, alias and uh-huh. we 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 um sometimes we found this um word in social media when social you write media. the conversation when you write the message aka yeah. aka sports also alias yes. alias alias, yeah. alias. Yeah. <laughs> okay English, so, so. What else? Um, BF or BF the boyfriend. 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 All right. That's English. Uh, to Indonesia. Yeah. They the, use it as a slang. In yes. Indonesia. Oh. All right. So next we want to share. And now we have Mr. Zigal here. Hi, Mr. Zigal. Hi. Hi, Mr. Zigal. So Hello. happy to see you. Yeah. yeah. And so late to come here. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. We have um, we happy to mm-hmm. have you in mm-hmm. our studio. Welcome to Smart Up Your Life. I, I thank you for having me anyway. <laughs> So okay. Um, now we talk about our topic tonight is um, yes. actually about slang on a daily conversation. Mm-hmm. In the past, in the last session, yeah. we have we talk about um, the Indonesian slang language, and we translate it to English. And now we want to know about how your experience. You have a lot of friends from abroad. Wow. You have the bule <laughs> friends. <laughs> The bule friends. <laughs> the bule friends. Uh, and uh, you yeah. know, I think you know about this, they, their slang language that they use in their daily conversation. Could you tell us some of them? Okay, well, uh, if you're talking about the slang words or anything about slang stuff and anything, um, it depends on the country actually you, uh, mm. they're from. I mean, uh, if you're talking about the US, UK, Canada, and also Australia, they actually have different slang. Oh. And what makes me wonder is only one thing. Why they have different slang? That's the question. And the answer is, mm-hmm. that's going to be a surprising for you. Um, because they have different official animals. Can you imagine that? I mean, uh, how to say? They have different official, uh, of, uh, official animals. Uh-uh. That's why they have different slang. All so right. I'm not quite sure why. But if you're talking about slang, that's uh, going to be like, how to say, uh, tend to uh, rough words, you know, like um, you, you don't want to swear here. Mm-hmm. You know? So, yes, it's offensive a little bit. So um, slang is very needed. Mm-hmm. It's a need uh, for teenagers. Mm-hmm. If you want to talk to your friends, but not talk to your mom and, uh, and dad with the slang words, because it's going to be like uh, not polite to 
kids, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, but if we talk about the slang word or mm. uh, sentences, is that always refers to the bad meanings of the word or what? Not all. I mean, some. Mm. Only some. But tend to rough words. I mean, not all slang words are, uh, how to say, offensive, like Mm-mm. rough, but some of them. And especially when teenagers do uh, the slang words yes. in, in the USA. Yeah, they're going to be like, are you swearing or something? Mm-mm. Yeah, it's just like, uh, you know, it's it's not polite to use slang. But some, how to say, some are not really, uh, really rough, not really rough. Mm-hmm. You know, like, uh, gonna is also a slang word. And also, wanna. Wanna? Yeah, from wanna. Want to? All right. From going to. Mm-hmm. And some of them for sure. And um, yeah, like, uh, what else? So many, actually. So many. <laughs> yeah. All right. Yeah. And now we want to know about it. We want to know about yes. it. Yes. Could you tell us the example word or sentence that are very popular mm-hmm. in another country? And maybe also we know um, we, we 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 sometimes hear the word, but we 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 don't know what it what does that mean. Okay, tacky. Do you know what it means? No. Yes. What tacky is? Taki 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 no, taki. It's, <laughs> <laughs> it's different. Oh, that is your favorite song. Oh, yeah. Taki taki rupa. Taki means uh, how to say norak in Bahasa. Oh. Yes. And so taki. Yes. How to spell uh, it? T a c k y. T a. It's tacky. T a c k y. Oh, tacky. Tacky. Nora. Like, um, man, I don't want to wear that thing. Why? It's tacky. I just, I just don't want to look tacky. Okay. I just yeah. don't want to be Nora and uh, tacky people. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's that's wrong. That's okay, right. okay, okay. Next, next. And also, this interesting. what else? Ratchet. Have you ever heard of it? Ratchet. Or How to spell? Ghetto. Ratchet is a lie. Oh, <laughs> hey man, why do you? Is a lie itself the 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 English language? It's a, a lie. It's, it's a coming. Lie. It's coming from USA actually. Oh. USA, yeah, it's coming from USA. So yes. my friends always say, ratchet. And they're like, you know what? I have a lot of friends put weird names in their uh, Instagram account. Yes, you know, and they are or maybe Facebook account. Like um, Riva sayang mama papa, <laughs> like that, right? Don't put like that name. Like Cinta Celalu Celamanya. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Just like that. Don't put that name on it. Because uh. you're going to be, you're going to be ghetto. You're going to be ratchet. <laughs> How to spell it? Ghetto is G-H-E-T-T-O. Can I, want, can I ask you one question? Okay, what? Is this a spelling bee competition? <laughs> no. <laughs> But we want to know how to, how yeah, the, okay. the, the writing of the yeah. word. G-H-E-T-T-O. Oh, Mm-mm. ghetto. Ghetto. Yes, ghetto. It means a lie. Don't be ghetto, man. A lie. <laughs> Don't be ghetto, man. <laughs> okay, next, next. What else? Um, lot. We have a lot of slang words actually. I mean, okay. Which is very interesting. But if you were asking me this way, I'm gonna be like, okay, what else? <laughs> yeah, you have to think. Yeah, I have to well, think. I, first. Okay, I will give you five minutes to think. Okay, that's not enough. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, and also smart listener, um, I want to read some comments oh, sure. on our uh, YouTube channel Smart FM Makassar from the Tarsji Asap ASAP I S A S A P as soon as possible. One as oh yeah, as soon as possible. One of my favorite ones anyway. Okay, ASAP. Yeah. How to say? ASAP. ASAP. So from Sri Nelly Agustina, be passion. Be passion. Be passion. Bersabarlah. Yeah. Okay. Is, the, is it the slang? Uh, I think it's not. Yes, so, so. It's not. I, I okay. Think it's not. So, SMH. Shake my hand. Shake my oh, hand. What does that mean? Shake. Shake my hand. What does that mean? Like, like, you know what? That guy is doing something wrong. Oh, oh, oh my God. Yes. Okay. Yes. Ya ampun. Yes. Okay. Shake my ya hand. Ya ampun. Aduh, tidak nyangka. Like It's that. actually like for a tax language. Hmm, like yeah. We're, we're doing tax. I text my friend and always use that um, uh, 
in my tax. Okay. My, I'm a taxpayer. This is the same um, abbreviation also mm-hmm. on uh, on our tax language. AKA, AKA is known as yes, Elias Ali. Elias. <laughs> 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 that's a good one. I love it. <laughs> yes, now we. <laughs> Is that true? I am. I was thinking. Am I okay. wrong? Am I wrong? I was thinking that's going to be a new word to me. Elias. Well, Elias is not. <laughs> <laughs> you make it like a, an English pronunciation, I think. <laughs> okay. So, um, BRB. BRB. Be right back. Be right, right back. back. Yeah. What does that mean? Yeah, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. When you're, okay, when you're tunggu dulu, kembali kan nanti. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, sorry, so, saya tidak bisa berbahasa oh, Indonesia. Um, okay. Alright. <laughs> uh, <I'm, All> right. <laughs> yeah. So, a a vague, a a f a i k. What is it? As far as I know. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You know. It's included as well. A vague. A a f a i k. Yes. K. As far as I know, yeah. so AFK. Okay, away from keyboard. No, no, away from keyboard. Yeah, yes, yes, that's right. That's do you right. Yeah. do you from keyboard. think this? Mm, do you do you do you use, um often use this uh word? I used to. AFK. I used to when I type when how I type, to how to use it when I type computer. So you know, uh, before Instagram came in, before mm-hmm. Instagram existed. Mm-hmm. I was I was actually sitting on, on my desk and doing some chat with my friend from the USA uh, using the laptop or something like that computer. Mm-hmm. Uh, every time I want to um, I want to like can you please excuse me for a minute? Where are you going? Be right back. Mm-hmm. Brb. So I just uh, type brb. Brb. And also um, ttyl. Tt. Ttyl. What does that mean? Yeah. I always I always put those together. Like I I put uh, BRB and then I put again uh, TTYL. Talk to you later. Oh, talk to you okay. later. BRB man, BRB. Talk to you later. But oh. away from keyboard is like, sorry, uh, away from keyboard. I was away from keyboard. That's Mm-mm. because I was oh. in the toilet or something. Okay. Yeah. Like you are in a busy situation yeah. or doing uh, something. You know, computer has. Keyboard, yes. But phones doesn't phones don't have keyboard uh, okay. at all. So oh. yeah, I mean, if you're if you're saying away from keyboard, that means that you're using probably computer or something oh. like that. Mm-hmm. So A F K, yeah. Uh, use using phone probably. I'm not quite sure if it if it's included. That's because I never I never find any situation like that using phones and uh, saying. AFK mm-hmm. there. Okay. Yeah. So, Muhammad Kifli. Muh Kifli. OMG. OMG. Oh my God. I think it's, yeah, yeah very familiar. It's too basic anyway. It's too basic. No, 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 no. no. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not saying it's too basic for him, but it's too basic using, use, use that thing here in, in mm-hmm. Indonesia. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, uh, it's too familiar to us. Yes. Yeah, Every but, people know. Yeah. But I have heard about uh, what is the different actually. God and gosh, is it the same? Or oh my gosh! gosh. Is slang. Oh, it's slang. Oh, oh, oh slang. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Am I teaching? Because you are the English enthusiast. This sharing session. Yeah, this sharing session. And how um and we we, we educate the smart yeah. listener yeah. already. So VIP. Very VIP. Very. Very important person. Very important person. VIP as well. Very, very important Wait, person. Wait, um, I'm curious. Gosh, where, where that, where, where, <laughs> where? Where does it the, come from? Uh, where does it come from? The word. Gosh. Gosh. Um, American? It's American. Okay. Yeah, okay. it's American. I, I heard that uh, from American people for the first time. Is that okay. word standalone or what? No, it doesn't stand, it doesn't stand anything, mm-hmm. I think. Okay, so um, Mukifli said Ima, Ima, I M M A, Ima, Ima, yes, Ima. Oh, it's I double M, right? Mm-mm. It's um, it's a short term. It's a short uh, for I M O. Ah, yes. I'm a English yes. teacher. I'm a yes. Teacher. I'm a. I'm not gonna introduce myself <laughs> as an English teacher with, with that slang word. Uh. I'm an English teacher now. Uh, it's like I M M A, 
Um, what is it? I'm a nice guy. It's like I'm a nice guy. I'm oh, all right. I'm, I'm a, it's just like give me. G I M M E. Give me. Yeah, it comes from uh, okay. give me. Why do people give like me. to simplify the words? Yeah. Wow. Well, well, let me ask. <laughs> let me ask the same. Yes, <laughs> that's the question, <laughs> and you have to answer it in the next session. Okay. We B R B. Be right back. <laughs> be right back. <laughs> Uh, the last question I gave to you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> This is the last segment, Mr. Zigal. Can I have time, please? <laughs> We will continue the conversation after this on air. <laughs> after this airing program. Um, why do people like to simplify the sentence into the word? Practical. Practical. Yes, so, that's the key word. Hyrule, Hyrule. What about, how, how, how? What do you think? Yeah. Easy to talk. Okay. Just to make it simple. Okay. I can hear your voice clearly. Actually, um, you're not a singer, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a singer. <laughs> okay. No, 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 no. Wait. Uh, please give your microphone, please, Mr. Sigal. Uh, okay. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> What is it working? Yes. Okay. So yeah, just to make easy, to make it easy mm-hmm. and to yeah, to easy to talk to people. Easy to talk yeah. to people because yeah, every people like to like a simple thing. <laughs> yeah. Like a simple things. Uh. So, and should we learn and use this lang word and language language in our daily conversation? Okay. Uh, in my perspective, yeah, it is necessary to learn about uh slang and also yeah, uh, short languages uh for our daily conversation because for me as a mm-hmm. young generation maybe uh it helps us when we want to get like a new relation or uh it help us to get uh more friends and mm-hmm. etc. Because if we uh use like uh formal language mm-hmm. uh most of the young generation the young people think that uh, we are a weird person if we yes. are too formal we use like a formal languages to them so yeah it is necessary for a uh, young generation actually okay. because we have to adapt we have to we have to look the situation where we have to um using the slang language itself because yeah it is suitable uh, to use the slang words Uh, only for the okay. young generation, not on, not like uh, to the older person, mm-hmm. older people, and etc. I see. Yes, Mr. Zigal, how often did you s- use the slang word or slang language in your daily conversation? Every um, time I t- in Indonesian or English? English. Mm. Oh, in Indonesian and English, but uh, uh, yes. Okay. How um, often did you use? Every time I talk to my friends, um, the bullet friends you are talking about, <laughs> and also every time I talk to myself. Mm-hmm. So I always, I always use slang. Yeah, slang words is. Uh, I think slang, slang words are very interesting. Okay. Um, to me and like. for. Um, uh, I I I ever heard about the um, word like, um, I don't know. Maybe you have ever uh, hear this word like um, a uh, PHP in English, like you said before. What mm. ghosting. ghosting? To ghost, to ghost, ghosting. Ghost, ghosting is actually. I'm not quite sure if it's PHP. Uh, ghosting is like you disappear suddenly. Yes, it's like that. <laughs> suddenly like, disappear. Yeah. Without reason. Yeah. I don't. I don't like that guy. Why? Wow. <laughs> He keeps ghosting. He keeps ghosting. Yeah. So you for know, the girls out there, we are, we're hanging out, and he comes over, and we're gonna say, "Pull up a chair, man." He pulls. He pulls up a chair and sit down together. And then we we're, were having some uh, talk, and Mm-mm. all of a sudden he just disappears. Okay, that ghost. ghosting. Yes, ghost, ghost, is like ghost. Is, yes, like ghost. Like ghost, uh. disappear. We can we cannot see anymore. Yeah. All right. So um, like salty, 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 salty is, word. Mm. Uh, annoyed. You feel annoyed, or mm-hmm. probably you're, you're in Indonesia like. Bete, bored, yes. Bete, bad mood. You're feeling bored, like mm-hmm. you, if you if you are bored. Mm-hmm. So, um, 
don't be salty. It's just a simple matter. Mm-hmm. You know. Okay. It's a trivial matter. It's not. It's not a big deal. Don't be salty. It's not a big deal. Yes. It's okay. not a big like, deal. Like, uh, it's not a big problem. Yeah. It's not a big re- deal. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, if you're talking about slang words, I, I think uh, one <laughs> hour or probably 30 minutes is not going to be enough. Mm-hmm. Okay. So uh, there is um, there are the comments okay. again from our are YouTube you channel. Yeah. You're not salty, right? No, no, okay. I'm not. <laughs> okay. I'm not. <laughs> Edward Emmanuel said, "Gotcha." Gotcha. Gotcha. Yes. Gotcha. I got you. Or am gotcha. I the only one having the <laughs> microphone here? <laughs> Yeah. Yes. Gotcha. For now, yes. Okay, I'm gonna. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. How? Gotcha. Uh, what does that mean uh, in Indonesia? Gotcha. In bahasa. Kena deh. Oh, yes. kena deh. Yes. Gotcha. Gotcha. I got your boyfriend. No, no. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. Okay. So. Uh, Jk. Clown, clown around. Clown around. Melucu. Okay. Clown. Cla- clown. Clown around. Like badut. Stop clowning around. Clowning around. Clown. Melucu. Yes. Joking. Yes. You always make jokes. You always make yeah. jokes. Even in a serious situation, probably mm-hmm. in a serious situation, everybody, uh, so you have a meeting with your probably mm-hmm. friends and it's a serious situation. Okay. And then uh, he comes with the jokes uh-huh. like that. So you can say, stop clowning in, around. In Bahasa slang word, in, ba- in Indonesian slang word, uh, Clown roll around, mm-hmm. or the people like to make a joke, mm-hmm. even in this serious situation. What is it? Please tell me. Uh, Jayus. 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 He is a Jayus, Jayus. one. He is Jayus. a Jayus person. Kayak, ah, you always melucu. <laughs> Jayus. Even if you are not funny. Uh, excuse me, if you want to talk, <laughs> <this> is- <laughs> please use the microphone, please. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's the matter, actually. What? So, yeah, we have the kind of friend Mm-mm. who always make the a joke. The Jayus friend. Yeah, the Jayus friend. Every uh. every every person has Mm-mm. that kind of per, uh, mm-hmm. friend. What? <laughs> oh, you, my you don't name. you don't have to mention it. You don't have to mention it. <laughs> okay, uh, that's Giba. <laughs> wow. How do you say it in English? How to say it in English? Uh, Giba. Gossip. Gossiping. Okay. So. Uh, vocabularies maybe you have oh no 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 slang. I almost forgot uh, how to understand the slang word mm. if we come into the uh, what the 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 groups or environment that yeah we feel very weird like we don't know their language their slang language how to understand Do you have any tips or trick? Maybe you want to share to us, Mr. Zigal. Why are you handing over? <laughs> well, uh, if you're talking about that thing, I mean, how to understand, right? Um, well, it's not only about the slang one, but uh, everything in English. Okay. I mean, if you want to understand people, first of all, dare yourself. Okay. Get into it. Use um use the English. Speak English all the time, and you're gonna hear. You're gonna hear uh, new words, new vocabularies, like new slang words. And if you if you find one, don't ever be shy to mm-hmm. ask around. Okay. If you don't understand, just ask. Okay. What does that mean? So you know what? I was talking to my friends from Philadelphia, mm-hmm. in the USA, and I was talking to my friend from a uh, friend from Frolly, 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 <laughs> Frolly. Florida. This this, this the tongue so, twister. Yeah, it's not it's not tongue twister. Florida. So I was talking to him in Florida and also, also to him in mm-hmm. uh, Philadelphia. All right. So um, I used the same words, but they um, one of them didn't understand. Mm-hmm. So I was like, "Hey, it's in English." Mm-hmm. And um, my friend from Philadelphia said, "Please tell me more about slang words." Okay. You should tell me more about slang words. You're you're the native one. I'm Indonesian, and you're you're you were born uh, in the USA. You grew up there, and you know everything about. That's your language. Mm-hmm, so you mm-hmm. have to tell me about the language. Okay. But he said to me that you know what, you're an English teacher, so you know more of um, the words than I do. Okay. Okay. Yes, so. that's because we all, always observe. The the point is, yeah. If you want to, if we want to understand the language or the slang itself, don't 
never stop to hear, never mm-hmm. stop to understand, to learn. And yeah, someday we 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 can use it and we we can understand. Okay. William Shakespeare, <laughs> sorry, William Shakespeare once said uh-uh. in his What? book, "Practice makes perfect." Practice right. makes perfect. Thank you so much, Mr. Zigal, for your yeah. time, and also Nawi, Harold. Thank you so much, and we will back again mm-hmm. next week. I'm so much. Am I invited? <laughs> yes. Um, I think I will. <laughs> Are you gonna have me again? <laughs> I oh, think okay. I will. Yes. So. Thank you so much once again, Mr. Zigal, Harold, and Ahui. And we'll see you again next week. Riva Majid, uh, say goodbye to you. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs>